Yo! What's poppin'? So I haven't posted in a while, but I need to start being on my A game. But uh, I want I wanted Here to play this game because the only time this game was fire. For an evidence search, unless there's some kind of catch. Ever the optimist. It's uh, it's LA Nowhere. It's where, like you play it like as a cop or something. I don't know, but we finna see. Floyd Rose homicide. You might back up. Yes, sir. Phelps and Dunn, Wilshire Division. We had a shooting took place down this alleyway. We have the Vic, Scooter Payton, a Negro male bagged up and on his way to Central Morgue. Look at me in this cool and smoking a cigar. All up in our face and junk. Vic's head and then threw his piece. I need you guys to try and recover the gat. You want us to look anywhere in particular? Give it your best shot, guys. The dead guy's a low life. I'm not expecting any miracles here. And if we recover the weapon? Bag it and return it to technical services. You hurry it up, Floyd. We I'm got places here. to be. Happy hunting. Think we'll be looking for a gun or something? This is a fist hump. Just going through the motions. You're probably right. Let's just get it over and done. All right, have it your way. We'll search right up to the back wall. If you still don't come up with anything, come find me and we'll talk it out. Two heads are always better than one. No good to me. Look at this junk. Let's go all these bottles. Probably not. Pick through other people's trash. Don't think this is anything. Yeah, that ain't nothing. That ain't nothing. Jesus. Cole, come take a look at this. Wait a minute. Newspaper. For, oh, so newspapers are important. What have you got, Phelps? Anything? Shrink says the mind is the final form. Dr. Fontaine, could I have a word? Of course, young man. I really enjoyed your lecture, Doctor. Psychiatry seems to have a tremendous amount to offer. Why, thank you. I'm always happy to receive acknowledgement for my work. The mind is... I was back in the day, I was in college going crazy. Medicine. Are you thinking of specializing, Mr... Sheldon. Or Courtney Sheldon. I'm only in second year, Doctor. They fast-tracked me a year. Because of my experience during the war. Ah. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. Battle fatigue and collapse under duress. Can it be helped? I would say yes. Given the right set of circumstances. Trauma forces the mind to close down, retreat in on itself. We try to find ways to unlock the mind again. Through a combination of therapy and drug treatment. Hypnosis and therapy are powerful tools in the right hand. Shift. I've been to visit some of the guys at the VA hospital. A good friend of mine. He's so far away. It's like he's wandering around. You went through a lot together. Yes, Doctor. Give me his details and I'll make a prognosis. I have a number of clinics in Los Angeles, Courtney Sheldon. And your penance, or your friend's help, is to come and work at one of them in your spare time. With what little spare time a medical student has. Is that a deal? Is it ever? I, I can't thank you enough. I'm not promising a cure, Courtney. I want you to remember that. Every physician has patients that he cannot hope to cure, for whom he can only smooth the path to death. What does that even mean, bro? I'm jinxed. I always get landed with this crap. So he, he used to be my professor, huh? No, what the? Dr. Fontaine. Uh-uh. Could I have a word? Of course, young. Say you swear, got to watch it. enjoyed your lecture, doctor. Psychiatry seems I can't to have a tremendous amount to offer. Why, thank you. I'm always happy to receive acknowledgement for my work. No, give me out, give me out, give me out. The last great mystery in medicine. 
Are you thinking of specializing, Mr. Sheldon? Or Courtney Sheldon? I'm only in second year. I didn't even mean to click me on this here. shit. Because of my experience during the war. Ah. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. Battle fatigue and collapse under duress. Can it be helped? I would say yes. Given the right set of circumstances, trauma forces the mind to close down, retreat in on itself. We try to find ways to unlock the mind again through a combination of therapy and drug treatment. Hypnosis and therapy are powerful tools this thing, in the right hands. Uh, I've been to he's wearing a turtleneck. He's not hot. A good friend of mine. He's so far away. It's like he's wandering. We went through a lot together. Yes, Doctor. Give me his details and I'll make a prognosis. I have a number of clinics in Los Angeles, Courtney Shelton. And your penance, or your friend's help, is to come and work at one of them in your spare time. Yo, come on, man. I really didn't mean click on this again. Is that a deal? Is Give me out of here. I, I can't thank you enough. I'm not promising a cure, Courtney. I want you to remember that. Every physician has patients that he cannot hope to cure. All right, all right. For whom he can only. All right, we heard your corny quote. Come on in. My boy, a little dripped out though, don't you think? He a little dripped out during college. The hair he got oh, it's not it. That haircut he got is not it. Find it. It's a waste of time. Bro, calm down, bro. I was stuck in the damn cutscene. Oh, it's blood spatter. Shooter put him up against the wall and blew his brains out. Hell of a way to go. Doesn't really matter how you go once you're gone. <laughs> Don't get all deep on me, Phelps. Damn. Okay, that's the only clue we found so far. That's the gun? Ralph, there's something on the rooftop. How the hell did you see that? A reflection in the window. Looks like it might be our weapon. I'm gonna see if I can find a way up there. All right, don't hurt yourself. I won't slime me. I mean, something without drinking or something. So. The gun's up on the roof, right? So we need to find a way up. What do you think? The gun's up on the roof, right? So we need to find a way up. Yeah, I'm, I'm a police what officer doing everything. Guys think we are. I'm climbing now? What the heck? Is this the gun? Smith and Wesson, serial S71893. Hmm. Two rounds fired, and instead of dropping it down a drain, our shooter hoists it up here. Interesting guy. Hmm. We should follow up on this now, before the perp tries to leave town. Hmm, blessing. So the person, the victim, died in two bullet shots with a Smith and Wesson. 
I don't know no one. Who the hell is this? All right, bro. This game a Negro Mill really was that serious? We have the gun, Cole. Let's take it back to Central. We could get a commendation. Could show some initiative, Ralph, and see if we can come up with an owner. That's a long shot, Cole. It's a pretty fancy gun. You know a local gun store? Sure. There's a place a couple of blocks from here. We're going to that gun shop. Location. Go to location. Are you sure about this? It's not really our gig. No harm in doing some digging. The suits didn't seem to give much of a damn. Such a little boy scout, Cole. You can't wait to get out of that uniform, can you? You'd rather round up drunks and help old ladies across the road? I'd rather get through the day without the captain's foot up my ass. It'll be fine, Ralph. You worry too much. Wake up, Cole. This is not even our car. The words are going too fast on top of the screen. I can't read. Man, move. I'm trying to be like Batman out here. Be top investigator of the world. And my partner ain't doing nothing. Man, let's get out of here. We're going to a gun store. Gun stop. Okay, so the what the the killing weapon was a fucking Smith and Western. Yo, can you ever if I leave you? Dang. Yo, move. Take the next left. Oh, I can just access. I can just ask him where to go and he'll I bet. Next right. Take the next right turn. Move. I'm in a hurry. I gotta go to a gun store. Turn left when you can. Move. Ain't people don't know how to drive, bro. I swear. I swear people don't know how to drive. Officers Phelps and Dunn. Can you tell us anything about this gun? Smith & Wesson. Model 27 registered Magnum. Chambered for 357. Nickel plated with pearl grips. Same gun used by General Pat. <laughs> You're not suggesting he's the owner? No, I'm not. You seem to know a lot about the weapon. I ought to. I sold it. You know this piece will stop a rhino. These babies are only available special order. Here's my Smith & Wesson order book. You mind if I take a look? Be my guest. See, I like cooperative bad, right? people like you. 
Model 27 with pearl grips, Cole. You see it on there? Wait, what? 27 with pearl grips. This is blasphemy at this point. Twenty-seven. This is not it. This says walnut grip. This is only twenty-seven. I see though. Okay, it's clearly not it. Twenty seven with my Right here. We're in luck. Errol Schroeder. Two oh three South Glass Street. Ordered the gun in February forty six. Thanks, you've been a big help. Anytime. Always happy to help out the LAPD. Thank you. See, I like cooperating with people like you. Cooperating with people like you don't have to... Can we call it in? Let's see if he's at home. Owning the gun doesn't prove he pulled the trigger. Okay. In for a penny, in for a pound. Lead the way, Gunga Den. Hmm. Excuse me, cops coming through. I'm on an important investigation. I gotta find out who killed this man. Oh! Now that wasn't so hard, was it? Just because we're in uniform doesn't mean we can't use our initiative. I guess so. Seems a little too good to be true. One of a kind murder weapon bought locally using a real name? If Schroeder's our shooter, he's no criminal mastermind. Most of them aren't. That's why they get caught. Two out of every three crimes are done on impulse. Another fact from the Phelps Encyclopedia of Thin Air. You really are full of it. Hold on, I was just drifting. I'm down here going crazy from back in the day. Nah, but I'm on his ass. This man starts to lie. Stay on this road. Go straight over the intersection. All right. Go. Go straight. We here. Two hundred three South Gliss Street. How you even cross the road? Why is it? It says go handle doors. Ain't every door? Inspect the mailbox and learn the suspect. Heard you. Schroeder, apartment two. How long can we beat him up? Oh, right here. Open up. What do you guys want? I'm Officer Cole Phelps. This is Officer Dunn, Wilshire Division. You're the owner of a Smith & Wesson Model 27, nickel-plated with pearl grips? I might be. What of it? Then you'll be surprised to know that Scooter Payton was murdered tonight with your gun. You're out of your mind. Scooter? 
He works for me. I have that gun here in my drawer. Missing. What the fuck is going on here? You're under arrest, Schroeder. Cuff him, Ralph. No way. You're not taking me down for this. Oh! Oh! What? You mad? You going down. Oh, you go. Oh, you going to jail. We? We? Come here. Come here. I'm sick of you. Oh, we? Come here. Come here. Oh, we? 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 Oh, you called me locking one time. Oh, two times. Come here. Sit down. You going to jail. You going to jail. Come here. Come here. Go to jail. What is wrong with him? Ralph. You Who right? just knocked out my partner? He's fine. I hardly felt it. He's lucky he caught me off guard. That's all I had to handle that for you. I'm gonna take a look around. I had to handle that for you. I had to handle that. I got you, Ralph. You my guy. Incidental. What is this? A comic book mixed with titles? You should look at us. Hmm. Optimistic call. Seeing bottles at the crime scene, huh? Uncle, that's how we walk now? That's how we roll? I knew you killed the this name. This doesn't pertain to the case. And we're searching everything. I can't trust Cole. He's trying to beat our ass. Well, he wasn't going to beat my ass, but he tried to beat. Hmm. Apples, huh? So he eats apples? How pull out my flashlight? Hmm, he was eating some food, huh? It would take a smarter man than me to connect that. What is that? I don't know what that is. Hmm, he likes white and green mugs, huh? Hmm, really suspicious. Hmm. Hmm. What is this? A notebook? A passport? Let's see. What is his names? Your numbers? Nine four. What does this mean? We in nineteen forty six. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Names in a series of numbers. Floyd Rose's name is in this book. Phelps, we can come out of this all bright and shiny with a commendation, or stick our schlongs in a hornet's nest. Call it in, partner, and leave the book where you found it. Mm -hmm. Phelps, that's twelve forty-seven. So that's how we're rolling now. Sons of bitches, get in this line now before I lose my temper. Excuse me, Sergeant, but. Excuse me? Fuck you! You say another word and I'll break your fucking head and have you in the brig. Some of us are here for. I know why you're here, asswipe. I'm having a bad day, Private. Some people don't seem to want Ooh, to. Oh, Abbott's breathing hard all up in our face. Can you believe this guy? Who are you two? Abbott and Costello? We're here for OCS, Sergeant. So it's the three fucking stooges and you're here for OCS. God help this fucking country in the USMC. The Japanese will do the world a favor and kill you quickly. All three of you are on report. What are your fucking names? Phelps. Kelso. Merrill. Any other gentlemen for OCS? OCS is at Elliot. You take the Camp Elliot bus over there. This bus is for MCRD. 
This bus is for men who want to fight. Bro, you're not gonna force me to fight in a war, bro. That's so dead, nigga. I do what I want. I don't care. I don't care. Duck that dude. When I, next time I see him, he's all smoke. How about he come catch these hands? How about that? Well, you picked the right place, Cole. A city that needed an honest cop like a thirsty man needed water. You'd heard the stories, but you weren't interested. You were here to fight the good fight, solve cases, right wrongs. But the force is like politics. There's no city on the fence. You have to choose sides. A brown paper envelope or a Greyhound ticket to Palookaville. It could only ever end one way. All units, a 211 in progress and shots fired at Westlake Savings and Loan, 1415 West 3rd Street. Unit to handle identifying code 3. We'll take that. It's only a couple blocks from 14 here. 14 Adam calling KGPL. We'll handle the 211. Roger that, 14 Adam. Be advised, suspects are armed. Shots fired, huh? Billy's on the KGs. Let's get it popping. Oh, what? Oh, move! God damn! I won't move this rubber. We won't hit this alleyway. Oh, shit. Was that... Was that gunshots? What'd you think? What'd you think, partner? Make it quick, you guys. The cops are here. We gotta move it. Oh, they busting. Oh! Partner, get down. Oh, yes, sir. Looks like I gotta get that big Draco. Y'all think I'm playing? Oh, y'all think I'm playing? I'm fucking top flight security. I'm top flight security guard of the world. Come here. Go, I'll hold them. Weapons on the ground now. You're fucking toast. Poke your head out, dude. Top flight security guard. Try for the front door. Keep your goddamn head down. Use the cover, Phelps. That's what I'm doing. I don't know how many are in there. That's what I'm doing. Slow. I'm tough like security guard of the police. LAPD, put down your weapons. The bank is surrounded. I'm offering you Not a, a chance to. Chance, copper. Yeah. Stay down. I see you. Stay get him, get him. Stay in cover, son. That's it? We got them all? I think we got them, Cole. Should be all clear. Mm. Lieutenant Hopkins says anytime you reach for the shotguns, you're either going to end up dead or wearing a citation. So I guess... It's okay, Ralph. You did well in there. I'm glad you had my back. Word. Man couldn't ask for a better partner. Well, we did good together, Brody. I was, I was 12 flight security police of the world. What the fuck are you talking about? This kind of opportunity comes along once in a lifetime, Hank. <laughs> I have to grasp it. You have to survive at first, Cole. Here are the veterans. The Japs love to shoot officers. If I can make a name for myself in this war, my future... Thinking of taking on a company of the Emperor's finest single-handed? You don't seem the Sergeant York type to me. When I need your opinion, Kelso, I'll ask for it. Whoa! What are we like yelling for, we boys? Pay. They call it the Custer Syndrome. Guys who go around dreaming of fame and glory and getting all of their men killed in the process. Our duty is to lead, Kelso. And their duty is to die for your wonderful future? Kelso speaking facts, though. Cole Phelps and Jack Kelso. With some people, it's as simple as chemistry. Two guys who should have been friends their personalities got in the way. Phelps, a good guy, wound way too tight. And Kelso, a quiet man who could never walk away from a fight. 
Well, it's a shame you don't like to talk about it, Cole. Ralph, friends who want to stay friends don't discuss religion or politics. And in my case, you can add the war to that. I know that bum. Wendell Bowers. I put him away before he jumped for all. Get after him, Phelps. I'll head him off in the car. No. Wendell Bowers! Hey, stop. come here! You can go hey, come here! I need to talk to you about something! Oh, uh, don't make me, don't make me, don't make me catch you, don't, oh, don't make me catch you, don't make me catch you, don't make me catch you, don't, because I will get you, when I get you, I will beat your ass, right for running, Stop now or I will shoot. I'm coming, I'm coming to get you, hey, what's my partner doing, come on, oh, oh, I'm coming, oh, I'm coming, don't be scared, don't be scared, I'm coming, I'm coming, okay, you want to listen, okay, Okay, you definitely finna catch these hands when I get you, though. Stay the hell away from me. Nah, come here. Come here, you suspect. Oh! Oh! You gotta be kidding. So, resisting arrest, too. Okay. So, that's for in the mornings. This for resisting arrest, I'm gonna beat your ass twice as hard. How about that? Come here. You wanna jump, huh? Come here. I've done my time. Nah, get over here. Let me talk to you about something. Let me talk to you about something real quick. screwed me once. Hey, I need to talk to you about something. Real quick. Oh, I'm gonna beat you. Get up, Bowers. There's nowhere left to go. Come here, prime suspect. Oh, oh. god damn. Like he just knocked out. my cap off, nigga. Oh, but you want. I told you when I catch you, you want to catch these hands, right? We, 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 oh, yeah. What? What you want to do? Get off the ground. Stop playing with me. What I say when I catch you, you, you beat I'm gonna beat your ass. That's what I said. He's got a hole in his life for an asshole like you. You can make it up to him in ten years time. Word. Watch your head. This was this no rest. Make sure was this no rest gets a ten plus years in it. Nice work, Cole. You run track in high school? What did you do, Phillips? I had a taste to do. He knocked my cat muffin cap back blue. Part of the tradition he of the Marine Corps and being an officer. He make my shit like with a close one. To make tough decisions. The right decision is not always the popular one. The right decision will get the men you care about killed. These ratings and your ability to give them frankly and truthfully directly affect your chances of successfully becoming a Marine officer. Candidate Phelps, you have the floor. Esprit de corps, Merrill, 10, Franklin, 8, Weiss, 8, Donahoe, 6, Kowalski, 6, Hudson, 5, Kelso, 2, Leadership, Donahoe, 8, Franklin, 7, Merrill, 6, Kowalski, 6, Weiss, 5, Hudson, 5, Kelso, 1. Candidate Kelso. I'm sorry, Captain, but I joined the Marine Corps to fight the enemy, not get involved in this schoolboy chicken shit. Kelso, in my office, now! Why his face look like that? Y'all saw his face? It was all... Like, morphed. Like, it looked weird. For every cop, there's the case that makes you. Gives you that leg up. Gets you recognized as the shining new star in the squad. Right, 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 right. The case that you solved that shows that you have the gumption. The gung ho, the get up and go to make you stand out from your average rank and file patrolman. Right. This could be the one goal. Could be. A shooting just happened like that in public? LAPD, could you stand clear of the body, please? Has anyone called an ambulance? We've called an ambulance and the police, but I'm afraid he's dead. Okay, stand further back and move along. It's your choice, but make it quick, people. Hey, Cole. You got here quick. My beat crosses 7th Street. Okay. You're first reporting, then. We'll get a perimeter going and move the crowd on. You better see what you can find out before the homicide dicks show up. I'll be with you in a moment. All right, all right. Everybody stay back. Let's How does it happen job. like that in public, though? Like, broad daylight. A crowded right? street. I've seen everything. Jesus. Mm. 
Mm, not no long to head. That's his name. Galetta. Layway receipt. Pearl earrings. Made out to Bank of Arcadia. Hmm. All right, all right. Yes, it's a dead person. What? Did he just say, all right, all right, it's a dead person? That's not normal. Bro, this has to be everything. Okay, so was it in the shoe shop? We should make sure we've checked the whole crime scene before questioning the witness. Uh, can I can I help you, sir? I'm Officer Phelps, miss. I'm here about the shooting. Did you know the victim? <laughs> he was my boss. Damn. Mr. Gage. Mr. Gage's first name. <coughs> Everett. Wait, what? did she say Mr. Gage? <coughs> Clovis. <coughs> Mr. Gage. <laughs> Mr. Gage. What a gay name. Do you think you could tell me exactly what happened, miss? I look around the shops at lunch. I was in a store when Mr. Gage, my oh, boss, Gage. I'm retarded. In yelling that I'm late on my lunch. And? We came back. I was angry. I walked in front. I heard shots. I turned and saw Mr. Gage fall. Why are you looking like that? Hmm. You're lying, Miss Coletta. You know what happened and why. You're going to tell me. There's nothing to tell. I've done nothing wrong. How can you prove different? How dare you accuse me of lying? God, I think you're horrible. A man is dead, Miss Galetta, and it's a criminal offense. I'm restarting. Wait, where are we starting from the end? I'm restarting. I didn't mean to pick that. I wasn't paying attention. For every cop, there's the case that makes you. Gives you that leg up. Gets you recognized as the shining new star in the squad. The case that you solve that shows that you have the gumption. The gung ho, the get up and go to make you stand out from your average. Alright, y'all, no more restarting, no more restarting. I promise that's the last one. I, I, just, I wasn't paying attention. Like, I was, but like. <sighs> LAPD, could you stand clear of the body, please? Nah, but she was lying, though. We've called an ambulance and the police, but I'm afraid he's dead. Okay, stand further back and move along. It's your choice, but make it quick, people. Hey, Cole. You got here quick. My beat crosses 7th Street. Okay. You're first reporting, then. We'll get a perimeter going and move the crowd on. You better see what you can find out before the homicide dicks show up. I'll be with you in a moment. Everybody stay back. Let us do our job.
We got now, now. We got this. I'm not restarting. Odd daylight. I'm not restarting no more. Crowded street. Now I've seen everything. C. Galetta. Layway receipt. Pearl earrings. Made out to Bank of Arcadia. Make sure there's nothing right here, nothing on the arms, hands, no. Bullets. I found bullets. All right, all right. Shell yes, casings. The dead These look like thirty twos. Sir, I'm Officer Phelps. What exactly did you see? I heard the shots. I thought it was a car backfiring. Uh, I saw a girl run at the shoe store. You want to take a look around now? The witness can wait, Cole. We've got the perimeter. Mm. We should make sure we've checked the whole crime scene before questioning the witness. All these cops. It's got This is a secure area. You all need to leave. This was such a nice area. Oh, I found something else. The gun! FN Browning. Serial number 01138. Might need to run it by a gun store. Eagleson's gun store is a couple blocks from here. I'm finding stuff ever since I restarted. I'm going crazy. Speak to the witness before homicide arrives, Phelps. If you think she's lying, don't be afraid to get forceful. Verbally, of course. And don't accuse her of anything without proof. Lawyers love that shit. And if you're sure she's straight up, try the general approach. See what you can coax out of her. All right. Uh, can I can I help you, sir? I'm Officer Phelps. No, you ain't catching me this time. Did you know the victim? He was my this boss. Fake crying. You gonna get Mr. me? Gage. Mr. Gage's first name. Everett. And you are? Galleta. Clovis Galleta. Twenty-seven. Mm. Yo, why she staring like that? Why she, why she staring like that? Why she staring like that? Why are you just staring at me like that? Huh? I've done nothing wrong. I didn't even do anything. Do you think you could tell me exactly what happened? You know what I mean? I look around the shops at lunch. I was in a store when Mr. Gage, my boss, bursts in yelling that I'm late on my lunch. And? We came back. I was angry. I walked in front. I heard shots. I turned and saw Mr. Gage fall.
All right, here we go. You're lying, Miss Galetta. You know what happened and why. You're going to tell me. There's nothing to tell. I've done nothing wrong. How can you prove different? Your pearl earrings, Miss Galetta. You've been paying for them for a whole year. Stop lying and tell me what happened at the jewelry store. Oh, God. I won't lose the earrings, will I? You could lose your freedom, you little fool, if you don't stop. Is she worried about some earrings? Mr. Kalu. Clown? Edgar Kalu. He runs the jewelry store. He's showing me a lovely watch. Mr. Gage bursts in. Mr. Kalu gets very angry with Mr. Gage, and they start yelling at each other. Mr. Gage tells me that all of the things in the store are junk, nickel-plated, made in Japan, and yells at me to get back to work. Then what happened? We get back here, and I hear a loud bang. Mr. Gage clutches at his back. I hear another bang, and another, and another. Mr. Gage falls to his knees. It looked very painful. Which jewelry store? Hartfields. Broadway, between 5th and 6th. Did you see the person who shot Mr. Gage? Of course I did. Mr. Callu looked very angry. He kept firing the gun. He kept pulling the trigger. He threw the gun in a bin and turned and walked away. Walked away? You're making me angry, Miss Galetta. Is that what you want? Tell me why Mr. Kalu shot Mr. Gage. Word. Mr. Gage hates Jews. A lot of people do. It's not my fault if he has nice things. How many shots did you hear, Miss Galetta? It's difficult to remember. It sounded like there were so many. And they were so loud. Bang, bang, bop, bop. Boom, boom, boom. Bow. Like that. We need you to concentrate, Miss Galetta. Even minor details can become important later on. Well, there was one bang. Mm hmm. Boom. And then another. Bang. And then three very quickly bow, bow, close bow. together. Five. Yes, yeah, five. And I did find Thank five bullets. Hard, You've been very brave. We'll need you to make a formal statement about what happened to Mr. Cage. Does that mean I can still collect my... my Man, forget them pearls! Never mind. Fake pearls! Yes, officer, I'll make a statement. You freaking clown? Who are those in fake pearls when a person just got shot and died? Maybe if no. And yeah, I know this is the ring. Where's the suitcase? We have the murder weapon. And the murderer. The girl saw it all. Our killer works at a jewelry store called Hartfield. That's a couple of blocks from here. You thinking what I'm thinking? Tate, maintain the perimeter. We gonna go get that nigga. We're going to the jewelry store. You should take the next right. What? Don't you people have anything better to do? Oh, 
take the next right turn. Man, move! You in a new watch. No, Officer fuck your jewelry. Are you Edgar Kalu? Uh, no. Uh, Mr. Kalu is out back. He said he'd lie down. I'll buzz him for you. Son of a bitch! Go, Cole, go! He was lying. Oh, so you oh, so you are the killer. Oh, come here. Oh, when I catch you, when I catch you, I always gotta get him. Come I'm on, Usain Bolt. Come here, come here, come here, hey, let me talk to you, you wanna murder people in broad daylight, huh? Come here, come here, you even take no bus, now on my watch, now on my watch, no bitch, hey, come here, let me talk to you, look, cause when I catch you, I'm gonna beat your ass, when I catch you, I'm gonna beat your ass, so come here, come here, I don't wanna shoot you, but you gonna make me shoot you. I don't want to shoot you, but you're going to make me shoot you. Don't make it worse, Kalu. There he is, officer. Oh my God. Edgar Kalu. You're under arrest for the murder of Everett Gage. <laughs> the case that makes you, and the case that breaks you. Word, word, word. He Son, thought that someone was really sweet out here. He lucky I wasn't able to beat his ass, but I wasn't finna shoot him. Ruins your marriage. The case that keeps you propping up a bar as you relive the what-ifs, the might-have-beens, the half-leads, and the half-truths. The case that other cops murmur about whenever you walk past. The case you never, ever discuss. God's mill may grind slowly, but it grinds finely, son. I hear it's you who nodded our malefactor from the shooting yesterday. Yes, sir. Then tell me, Boyle. I hear you're quite the climber, a man of initiative. How would you like a chance at smiting this man with the sword of justice? You're asking me to, to conduct the interview, sir? I am, young Phelps. You've only been with us a short time and you've assembled yourself a stellar arrest record. Yep. Not to mention the fine work you did in the war, sending heathens back to the hell they came from. But I'm curious as to whether you can turn your hand to interrogation. It takes a certain animal cunning, lad. Do you think you might be ready for that? Yes, sir. I think I am. Good man. Uh, am I ready for that? Am I ready? Phelps. A motive, opportunity, hard evidence, and best of all, a confession. If you fail in the former, you can always use a modicum of violence to obtain the latter. How are you feeling, lad? Fine, sir. Very good. The evidence is overwhelming. May the cat eat him and the cat be eaten by the devil. Bring me a confession, young Phelps. This is your chance. Don't fail me. Has my lawyer arrived yet? I want to see my lawyer. A lawyer can't help you, Mr. Kalu. You shot a man dead in cold blood. You're going to have to pay for that. I think next next video we gonna. Yeah, next next video we're gonna interrogate this fool. Wait, can I not save? Yo, I can't save. I gotta do this? Alright, come on, come on, come on. And 
shooting, the layaway, the shells. The effing browning gun. The suspect. Possible reliable motive. Alright, let's get a cracking. You followed Everett Gage and the girl back to the shoe store. You put five rounds in Gage's back. Gage was a was a bastard. Whatever he got, he got what was coming. But it had nothing to do with me. What? I don't know why I'm bothering to try to help you here, Mr. Kalu. I could stand in front of the grand jury and say that you showed no remorse. The defendant is a cold-blooded killer. Very good, Boychik. Kiss my ass. I know what you're doing. I think I'll wait for my lawyer to get here before I make any kind of statement. Yeah, it's about time to end this. What if I restart? Yeah, I'm gonna end this video right here, y'all. I'm gonna pick up right back here.